What's going on, everybody? And welcome back to a brand new episode of Maximus the Forward. The title of today's video is going to be Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate versus Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate. Now, for those of you that might have never heard of either one of these flavors of soda, they are both rare sodas and very limited. And for those of you who may have never heard the story, of both these flavors of soda, allow me to give you a rundown. Starting first with Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate to your guys' left. You were to log in on Pepsi Sweepstakes. This was a Pepsi Sweepstakes item. You were to log into Twitter, Facebook, or Instagram. And on National Hot Chocolate Day, you were to post a picture of yourself holding a cup of hot chocolate and then you would be entered in to hopefully be one of the very few couple thousands of winners that got to win one of these. I think there was only 2,800 winners or 2,400 winners of this and all 2,400 of those winners won a two pack of these in a little cardboard box. Now, going on with the other one to your guys' right in my hunt. Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate had a very similar principle to Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate, but because it was owned by Dr. Pepper, Dr. Pepper themselves did a little bit of a different system in which it was a little bit more complex. Instead, with this one, what you were to do is you were to log on to this very rare and exclusive website called the Dr. Pepper Fan Perks website. This website was so incredibly exclusive that out of a complete 365 day period through the entire day, that website only opened up for just one day. And what you were to do is you were to buy Dr. Pepper bottles and you were to log into that website on the grand opening day where you had only just that one single day out of the entire year. And you were to punch in these codes or QR codes off of the Dr. Pepper caps off of regular Dr. Pepper bottles. And when you would do that, you would win points and you were to keep doing that, keep spamming new bottles to get the codes off of the caps to try to hopefully raise up enough points to where you could buy one of these Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolates, which came in a really nice packaged box that had nice artwork of this basically all over the box, which was a two pack. Came with a beautiful flashcard. This one came with a flashcard too. But just like Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate, the Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate was also very rare. And I don't know how many winners there were of this one, but it might have been like only three or four thousand winners. So there very well could only be like five to ten thousand of these cans in existence. This one, there's only like four thousand eight hundred of these cans in existence. And because these two have been around for quite a while now, which is basically two years, I have finally decided to collaborate Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate and Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate. And today, I'm going to give you guys a taste test and break down both of these flavors, let you know exactly what I think, and we're going to find out which one is the undisputed winner out of both of these. Ladies and gentlemen, this is... Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate versus Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate. Who will win? There's only one way to find out. Let's go. Oh my gosh. 
Oh, that still tastes just as good as I remember. <sighs> Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate is literally the absolute best tasting soda on my entire channel. And it is actually the very first video that I ever did as a serious YouTuber. Oh. oh my gosh, that is so good. When you take a sip of this Pepsi Cola hot chocolate, just imagine the absolute best freaking tasting chocolate ice cream that you could find in your entire life. And it is infused with Pepsi itself. Oh man, just the way that they infuse the Pepsi with this Pepsi Cola hot chocolate is just fantastic. Even my cousin Aaron Davis tried this and he couldn't believe how good it was. As far as the Pepsi goes in this Pepsi Cola hot chocolate, you can taste the Pepsi a little bit, but you see that swirl of chocolate on the top of the can as far as the graphics go? Just imagine it just being like <laughs> covering the entire can. The chocolate in this is very powerful. I don't know what they did to infuse this so well. But this is absolutely fantastic. Now before trying this one, I can tell you guys, this is a very legendary, rare, solid 10 out of 10. Absolute perfect score. Now let's get on to Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate. Okay, yeah. That also has a really good flavor. Really good flavor. But, I would say it's a little bit more of a one-dimensional taste than the Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate. It's not quite as dynamic. And here's the reason why. It doesn't taste bad. But literally what the Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate tastes like is it tastes exactly like a Tootsie Roll. Exactly. And Tootsie Rolls aren't even bad. I'm sure we've all had them. They're really good. So in this Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate, you can't even really taste the Dr. Pepper. Okay, I, I just got a hint of it on the aftertaste. But the chocolate, it's a very dominant Tootsie Roll chocolate that you're tasting on this one. Let's take another sip of the Pepsi Cola hot chocolate. Boy, I don't know. That's hard to score, both of them, comparing them. What I can tell you is if you are going to do a taste test of these, it would be very smart to drink the Pepsi Cola hot chocolate first, which I'm glad I did. Because what I'm finding out is that the Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate, as soon as you take a sip of it, it can actually hinder the actual taste of Pepsi Cola hot chocolate. But luckily I have tried both of these before in the past several times, so I know what I'm up against. I'm going to stick with my assessment on the Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate in a perfect score of 10 out of 10. Now the Dr. Pepper Fantastic Chocolate is not bad at all whatsoever because it has a very dominant one-dimensional flavor which is like a Tootsie Roll and then a very slight aftertaste of Dr. Pepper afterwards. I'm going to give this a very fair score of 8 out of 10. They are both very good. But I kid you not, 
on the entire history of my entire YouTube channel, I have never, I mean ever, tasted a soda that's better than this one. Both very good, but this one is just absolutely best here off the freaking hook. All right, guys. So Pepsi Cola Hot Chocolate, perfect 10 out of 10. Dr. Pepper, fantastic chocolate, 8 out of 10. You guys have heard from me. That's it. Maximus the fourth here, signing out. I thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.